Looking at these true choices, I will take it that you can guess what faction this is. Uh, we are versus Isengard. Versus, I yeah, versus Isengard. Who do I want to play? Who do I want to play? I'll do the Easterling. It's my favorite one. Mainly because their sword only has a swing profile and um, not a stab. So that way you can never like accidentally stab with the sword you always are swinging. And this map... Let's see what this map name is called. I can't remember. Siege of Care Andros. There you go. The Siege of Care Andros. I'm assuming that by the architecture and the name that this is a city in the Lord of the Ring or in Middle Earth. Uh, I've never read the books, only seen the movies, so I don't believe this city was mentioned in the movies. Or maybe it was, I just don't remember. So yeah, the enemy spawns out there in the uh, river area, and they can go up the ladder or through the front gate. Guess we have Nazgul's on our side. Really, you don't want to fight out in the lake. You kind of want to use the time for their slow approach through the lake, because they're, you know, they're slower in water, for the ranged people to kind of thin out their ranks before they reach land. But, uh, for whatever reason, these people want to fight out in their spawn point. So I guess that's where I have to go to get to the action. This is where uh, Isengard starts to get really tough, is when they start spawning these pikemen. These pikes are crazy. They're so fast. Long range. It's like basically like what I have right now. But I think even longer. Yeah. I think longer. Then I think it's at wave 9 or 10 maybe, is when crossbowmen start spawning with the waves. And like that gets really nuts. So my prediction is wave 12. Well, let's say wave 15. Wave And, you know, if you notice there's a lot of Lord of the Rings on my channel, I apologize uh, if that, you know, kind of bores you. But this is what's played all the time. All the time. It's like you can't escape it. So, that's what I can record. I don't really mind Lord of the Rings faction, I guess. They have various troop choices different play styles and they're solid faction you know solid faction so I don't mind it my guy's throwing potatoes because why not I still say this is a horrible idea to fight out here in the water.
Oh, great. A ranged wave. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Please. Please, no. So, I'm not going to survive backing up. I'm just going to have to sit here. And as long as you don't raise your shield, they generally don't hit hit it. Um, oh man, I'm, I'm fucked. I am fucked. Yep, alright. That was just a bad situation. Uh, my shield wasn't going to last that long. And with that many arrows, you saw that I was kind of getting that knockback effect and getting hit with an arrow at the same time. So I was... I was out of options. Out of options. And because everyone wanted to fight in the flipping water... Damn you! This is all good. I'll spawn in the next wave. Maybe I'll change it up. I don't think I've ever done an, an elf. Or at least it's been a while. Uh, they have a cool spear? Yeah. It's a cool spear. Do that. And yes, I did not choose a bow. I'm, I'm not a huge fan of just sitting back and uh, well, using bows. I, I find it kind of boring. Stupid pikes. F your pikes. I wish spears um, were better in this game. They're just, they're just kind of like one of the worst weapons, which is a shame because I love, I love using spears. Like in Dark Souls, my God. Spear shield combo. Love it. Love it. So here we are, pushing back out into the river. You know, I'm not going to do it this time. I'm just... No. I'm not going to do it this time. I'm just going to go back and heal. Why not? I don't want to die. So yeah, while I do find archery boring, uh, I do also know that it is needed, and I really appreciate everyone willing to just, you know, press the left mouse button over and over and over again while aiming in the general direction of an enemy. Although I guess that's kind of what melee is too, you just press the left mouse button. I don't know, I just find it more engaging though, I guess. My personal preference. Even in... Like other games, like the Total War games, I kind of prefer going infantry heavy as opposed to having archers. Or a cav. Which is why the uh, Rome faction in the upcoming game, Total War 2, Total War Rome 2, um, the Rome faction really is appealing to me because I know that they rely a lot on heavy infantry, which is what I love. I love heavy infantry. Oh damn! All right, so this is a berserker wave. Don't want to mess with them in melee if if you can help it. So I am going to retreat up to the wall, and hopefully the archers can take this wave out for us. You can call me a coward. You can say, "Oh man up." That's fine. How the hell did that guy die? Wow, 
Wow, look at all these arrows. That's a lot of arrows. Oh, right, right, right. So I, for I forgot. In the boss waves, there is a. Uh, there he is. See him? Lurtz is his name. He spawns, I think, in almost every boss wave. And he has a bow. That's how that guy on the ladder died. He got shot. Alright. I always forget about Lurtz. That bastard. How many times has that mother trucker killed me? Like, you wouldn't even see him, because he's, like, behind the wave, just firing away, you know, through all of his people, hits you in the, in the face, you never even see it coming. Alright, he's down. I can stand up now. Oh, hello. Hello, Berserkers. There we go. Get out in the open. Yep, yep. Damn you, blocking. Oh. See? If they're too close, you can't get the jab through. That's why, like, spear and shield doesn't really work. Because you just kind of dink like that and you don't do any damage. Or like very minimal damage. It just doesn't work. Unfortunate. Maybe in the um, upcoming Mountain Blade game that will be changed. It's called the uh, Banner Lords, I think. I'm kinda wondering if this guy's gonna try to troll me and step on my bed. Now the spear does work if the enemy's attention is on someone else and you can, you know, get the appropriate distance, of course. But one-on-one, -on -one, not that great. Or maybe I just suck with it. F feel free to tell me. Alright, so I believe there should be crossbowmen now that are spawning with the waves. Let's see. Yep. Yep, I can see him back there. Carrying his flipping crossbow. So I may get hit, hit with a random crossbow bolt. It's gonna suck if it happens, but hey. It's part of the game. The fuck? I want this to work. I want to be able to kill these fools with the spear, but it just... Yeah, there it... Oh, that didn't kill him. Oh well. I got my friends with me. And by friends, I mean complete strangers. Oh! Well, hello. War Riders. Get to the walls. Get to the walls. Me running for my life. I'm getting to the walls. Alright, I'm fine. Alright, I'm gonna just rest. Not much to worry about this wave. They cannot get up the ladder. And I don't think think even if they get inside I don't believe they can go up these stairs either I need a bed there we go
watch them just climb up these stairs until they just rape us. Nope. I was right. Now, if they get off the warg, that's a different story. Uh, I don't think my spear has the reach. And they can just block that. Alright, here we go. That was bad. Um, Alright, fuck it. I want the spear to work, but you know what? It's not working, it's not working. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I should have typed saying like they're on the wall or something. But I wanted to engage them there because I was afraid if I continued to back up they would have just ran down this line and killed all these people because they probably were not paying attention to what's going on back here. I should have typed. That was my bad. Let's see, I will go to... Rohana, I don't find interesting. I'll just do some Gondor stuff. Hmm. Do that. What is this? I'm looking for like a, a high swing pole arm or spear. So we got 16, 20, 20, 16. All right, so I'll just do that, I guess. Call that a day. That dude's a champ. Look at all these arrows he's got in him. I'm still ticking. Oh! One too many. And that was it. This uh, Stannis guy, he just keeps uh, trying to stay in character. Oh no. <laughs> oh, he's got followers. That stand is right there, the bald guy. I've seen him before. This dude's even called Baratheon Knight. Oh, God. Oh, this is great. Fuck the battle. I just want to see this roleplay go on right here. To the death, my lord. Let us die for the realm. Let us fight for the glory we seek. Yeah. Yeah. You balding Stannis. Let's do this shit. <laughs> I want him to die first. Oh. I didn't even see what happened there. <laughs> He's still up. Stannis is still up. And I need to heal. You know what? I'm just gonna get rid of this fucking pike. All that's gonna do is get me killed. I'm gonna try to. Uh... <laughs> oh, you think you're funny. You think you're funny. Alright. Alright, you live for now. Come back over here, though. We'll, we'll see who wins this fight, Mother Trucker. We'll see who wins this fight. Anyway, I forgot what I was saying.
You know, this sword looked bigger in the picture. Oh shit. Oh, we have been pushed back. This is not good at all. Alright, I'm almost dead. But they are not paying attention to me. What's going on? Whoa! Massive lag spike, apparently. That sucked. Alright, so I'll get rid of that. I'll get rid of the sword. I think this one's pretty large. Let's try that one. That elf got raped. Brave person right there. Trying to hold off the army. Oh yeah, so I just saw in the chat, this is a random side note, um, especially recently due to the season finale of Game of Thrones, season 3, there's a lot of spoiler talk in these in the chat that goes on sometimes in these games. So if you have not seen season 3, if you don't want to be spoiled on anything Game of Thrones, just try not to pay attention <laughs> to the chat going off in the bottom left corner because they will troll you without even knowing that they are. Two left. Okay. So there's one. And the other is beneath the ladder. Nice. Take it out at the same time. Alright, boss wave. Uh, Berserkers. That's great. That's great. I kind of fear for this wave here. We don't have many people left. Not enough bowmen to really thin them out by the time they get to the walls. I don't know. This could be it. This could be it. taking forever for these guys to walk up this ladder. It's a good thing. Don't get me wrong. Alright, these two guys need to retreat to another location and keep firing arrows. Alright, alright. Block, swing. Swing. No. Oh man. There you go, help him out, there it is. So yeah, these guys are just sitting there shooting arrows and missing, and, I'm, and I was just sitting there thinking, like, why don't you just go into melee? And they did. Get on them. Alright, we may make a pass this wave. Cause, 
I don't know, maybe. Oh, this war. Maybe. I, I guess. But that really doesn't explain why these guys aren't moving. Maybe the way that the AI is, they're aggro to them, so they're trying to walk to like a straight line, and they can't get off the. I don't know. I don't know. This is really weird. I'll take it though. Hey, I'll take it. Because, I mean, this isn't really exploiting, which I'm fully against. It's just the AI being really dumb. Just being just really dumb. Nice, got him right across the stomach. Where'd that, uh, that Gondor guy go? Oh, there he is. He's resting. Alright. I'm telling you, we got really lucky that this AI is only going up one at a time. one and they may have to actually go out there and get them um, the melee guy could probably aggro him from behind the walls and then the archers can pepper him there he goes I think that's what he's going to do you gotta just straight up fight him one on one Oh, he lasted so long. He was doing so well. That guy, not as, not as much. Not impressed. Alright, and we're back. I think this was the guy that was, um, who lasted so long. General Rack. Good on you, buddy. Alright, so going up the walls. Are we going to engage? Oh, 
Sorry, I'm not really talking. I'm just uh, kind of concentrating here. I don't want to die. Alright. Looks like we beat that wave down. I'm going to go rest. At this point in the game, you need to be at full hit points. Mainly it's to be able to survive the random like crossbow bolt that comes at you from these damn Urukai crossbowmen. Nine guys left. Eight. Miss out a point blank sniper shot. You know, I don't. I guess the sword's okay. Yeah, the sword's okay. Oh, I see. That orc guy decided to take a swim. Gotta keep your shield up. We'll see him crossbowman. There's not a lot of us left, so I'm going to withdraw. Hopefully everyone else does too. Oh man, don't don't sit here. Alright. Alright, alright. Let's hold him here, I guess. We'll die valiantly, I'm sure. I would connect before his. Misplay on my part. Hey, buddy, there's a. Uh, I don't want to, you know, upset you or anything, but. There's some angry warriors behind you. Oh my god. Oh, is he FK? That must be. I thought he was just resting and just like totally being oblivious to everything around him. I don't think I've ever used that shield. When you play Lord of the Rings factions as much as I have, you get excited for changing the, the shield type. Because <laughs> you've seen it so many times. Uh, whatever it takes to keep it a little fresh. I don't think I made a prediction this time, did I? Or did I? I can't remember. If I didn't, I'm gonna say maybe wave 17? Huh. Alright, interesting thing about this tower. Alright, so... Alright, yeah. This tower, I think... This section of the plank starting from here to about here is faulty. Uh, I think you can fall right through it, and I don't believe the AI can get past this part, this point. So if you want to be, you know, if you want to be one of those people, you can just jump from here to here with a bow, and then, well, glitch your way to victory, or with the, preferably a long-range weapon, because there's no. Refill station 
in this section. I'm gonna hang out with um, these Kings Guard <laughs> and the King, uh, not for role playing purposes, simply because it's a guaranteed group of people who will stick together, and that's always a good thing. So they can have the role playing, which is fine. I just want to have a group of people. How many people do we have left? Three. All right, we're not even going to get to respawn again. Unless this next wave is like war riders, and then it takes forever, and these guys just slowly pepper them down with ranged, then I don't think we're going to make it. <laughs> oh, what a long drop. Yeah, I think this is over. Two people. Where's the other guy? Oh, he's still up here? Okay. Against the pikeman one on one, uh, that this guy kind of did some mistakes. He kept backing up a little bit. Against pikeman one v one, get right up in their face, especially if you have a sword, and just fucking slice them. All right, so yeah, this is the glitch part of the. Oh man. Is this guy stuck? No, no, he's fine. No, maybe he is stuck there. He keeps rubber, rubber banding. And yeah, see, like, like the AI won't move past this point. It's like this whole area is just glitched. It just messed up. I don't know. So at this point, I think we just need to vote for a new map. Because this is effectively over. So, you know, actually, I'm just going to stop the video here. There's no point in watching the rest of this. Uh, thanks for watching. This was uh, Lord of the Rings Combined versus Isengard at Care and Dross, I believe this map was called. Thanks.